Don. It's the Iron Sheik. I'm coming to the ring from Detroit, Michigan. This is Rick Steiner. Rick Steiner, along with Missy Hyatt and Scott Steiner, who we just talked with, making their way to the ring. What a main event this should be. The former All-American, I underscore the word American, to take on the man from Iran, the former bodyguard of the Ayatollah. The Iron Sheik, the youngest man ever to represent his country in any Olympic Games. It was 1968 when he won a silver medal in the Olympics in wrestling. And yes, she's got two different shoes on, but so does uh, the man she escorted to the ring. I think Steiner's been picking out Missy's shoes in recent weeks. I don't know if a lot of guys even notice Missy's shoes, but there you go. The Iron Sheik starting out very quickly, trying to gain the early advantage here on Rick Steiner. This should be a most interesting confrontation. Come on, let's go. The veteran, the Iron Sheik, a man that has competed in various federations and associations in pro wrestling well over the last decade. A double tough individual. Rick of the eyes to Rick Steiner. Sends him in for the ride. Misses with a clothesline. Steiner got it. The Steiner line. That will make a man like him almost patriotic. Him hitting the Iron Sheik. Rick wants Scott to take a cheap shot on uh, the Sheik. And Scott thinking the better of it. Got behind the Sheik with a belly to back suplex. Lateral press. One, two. Got two out of it. Trying to backs away from that uh, intended kick, and now they're down like two pit bulls. Steiner ramming his head into the head of the Sheik, and now he's biting it. Great American Bash action still to come in the Bayfront Center in St. Petersburg, Florida. The Knight Center in Miami. Back in the downtown municipal auditorium in New Orleans. The Centroplex in Baton Rouge. Martin Coliseum in Little Rock. In addition to Kansas City. Great action in KC. Well, we know we're going to have a tremendous crowd there. I understand former NWA World Champion Harley Race may even be on hand at that big event. Lateral press night, Salto got two. We look forward to returning to the historic Keel Auditorium, the facility that the legendary promoter and former NWA president Sam Muchnick made famous. The Keel in St. Louis on Saturday night, August the 5th, and on Sunday night, August the 6th, it will be the Great American Bash final stop of 1989 in the world famous Omni in Atlanta. Fans of all ages are looking on at this big event. Great opportunity for the families to come out during these bashes. Now Steiner mimicking the Iron Sheik somewhat, trying to get the camel clutch. She did not cooperate with that move, comes up fighting. Sheik sends him in. Double chop right to the throat. Another lateral press. One, two, the near fall. And he got two. Sheik ran Steiner's head into the top turnbuckle. And now Steiner stops on his feet. Those big, uh, unusual boots of the Sheik, they do have feet in them. And at the end of those feet, there are toes. And this is not an anatomy lesson. Steiner, he goes for, goes for broke as he just stomps the Sheik in the midsection. The Steiners gearing up to make a run for the world's heavyweight. Tag Team Champion. 
championship. And speaking of the heavyweight champion, the world champion will be with us later in this hour. She tried to suplex. Steiner reverses it inside. Great one, two, three. He's got it. Great counter move by Steiner to get the pin. leaving with smiles on their faces as the Iron Sheik attempted the vertical suplex. As you can see right here, Steiner brought it down inside cradle. And he holds it. One, two, three. And Rick Steiner has won the main event. And we'll hear from Nature Boy, Rick Flair, in one moment.